Hello, I'm Mike from musicradiocreative.com. In this short tutorial, I'll show you how to get from this around the world, around the to get to something like this. We're talking Daft Punk vocals. Okay, a quick disclaimer at the start of this, you will need a few paid plugins. You'll need to get Vocal Synth from Isotope and also Melodyne, the fantastic auto-tuning software, which actually has a free 30-day trial. And I believe there's also a free trial on Vocal Synth. So you can try this all out for free. So how do I do that? Well, first of all, I have spoken around the world, around the world. Around the world, around. To the tune of Daft Punk. Well, not really singing it, but certainly the right timing. That first and foremost, is important. Then we head over into Melodyne, which is here loaded up. In fact, I've got an old project, so I'm gonna go new and start something brand new. Then I'm gonna go over to my finder and bring in this before sample of my voice, right? Very quickly, it will analyze that voice and it will give me the notes. It thinks it has not much range there at all. I'm not really singing, I'm speaking. This is where I can very quickly auto-tune my voice to get it to sound like Daft Punk's Around the World hit smash single. Um, so I do happen to know the notes, and I know that I'm going to need to go up around an octave here. So let me drag all of that audio up. Up to there, up to around uh, G, G3. Okay, and then I'm going to do G3, and then uh, G flat for out, around, and then we've got G3 again for the, the, at G3, and then we'll move world up to a up to a and then around back to g and then g flat and then g and then world up to b3 and then back to g3 let's have a listen to how that sounds not going to sound too good but let's give it a go around the world around the world actually it's not too bad it's just the last bit that sounds a little bit lame doesn't it so <laughs> let's see if we can fix that uh, now i'm going to go into file export so i can get it into adobe audition as a wav file and we'll stick it into punked and stick it there as a new file Okay, it's unable to export for some reason, uh, probably because I've already exported into that folder. Let's create a new one called uh, done. There we go. And there we go. Yep, it's done it now. Brilliant. Okay, here it is. Uh, we've got the punk before and the new track there. Okay, which is obviously a track that I didn't use. So now punk before actually becomes punk uh, tuned, so let's name it that, so I'm I'm not confused by my files. There we go, punk tuned, and I'll bring that into Adobe Audition. All right, there's the auto tuning. Around the world, around the world, around. So finally, to get that Daft Punk sound, we need to use a fantastic plugin uh, that I did review on my channel previously. It's VST3 and AU for Apple, if you like. Uh, let's go to VST3 and go to the vocal synth. This is where we can start getting punky with our sound. Default sounds here. Let's have a listen. Around the world. And we can start to do bits uh, like introduce a computer sound to it. That's going to help. Around the world, around the world. There we go. Around the world, around the world. And finally, I'm going to add in another one called the talk box right here. Uh, let's have a listen. Around the world, around the world. Sounding really good. Apply it. As you can see, there are many other effects and uh, different tweaks and dials you could go into with Vocal Synth. Uh, do watch my previous video on Isotope Vocal Synth because it's awesome and there's so much more you can do to it. Um, but there you go, very briefly, taking a vocal I recorded in Adobe Audition, auto-tuning in Melodyne, and then adding that Daft Punk sparkle around the world, around the world, around using Isotope Vocal Synth. It really is a combination made in heaven. I hope you try this out for yourself and leave a comment let me know how you get on and remember to subscribe for more videos